Ciao tutti, ahoy Shetsi, what's up everybody? It's Andre, back with a new travel vlog, and today we're going to Positano, Italy, in the Amalfi Coast. I got the day off, three hour drive, nothing to it but to do it. Uh, this is supposed to be one of the most picturesque, most scenic places you can visit in the entire world. Um, I've only seen it on, in videos and in pictures on, on Instagram. And Facebook, uh, I think I saw it on Will Smith's IG, I think I saw it on LeBron James' Instagram. Obviously, I'm not traveling on that level yet, but today, we're gonna go there, we're gonna experience it, and I can't wait to get there. Let's go. Hey, I'm not even to Amalfi yet. But this, I'm on the way, I'm about 20 minutes away. But this is what I see, wow. So this, this is just on the way, I'm just on the way. I had to pull over and stop and look at this, like. Man, if anybody ever is trying to decide to go to the Amalfi Coast, uh, Positano, go. Jesus. Jeez, this is a real raw reaction. Like, this is a first take. So, about to check into my Airbnb. Um, I parked on the side of the road, and um, hopefully, I don't have to pay for parking. Um, no one messes with my car. Uh, just waiting for the guy to show up for the Airbnb. Then I'm heading down there to have a good day. See you guys there. So welcome to the B&B Casa Fiorellina. And I got this on uh, Airbnb. Uh, when you walk in, bathroom and shower. Uh, no kitchen though. But he did leave like some water. You got the Italian coffee and Bedroom, just simple bed, nothing special. But the best part of this apartment is the view. So right now I'm just walking down these like this. I'm walking down from the top of Positano to the bottom to where the beach and all like the scenic views are. Um, I think it's like a 15 minute walk downstairs, so. Still walking down these stairs and my knees are on 10. Real talk, my knees is killing me, bro. So right now I'm in the Postiano city center. Um, it was about a 20 minute walk down those stairs from my Airbnb. Um, this is mid-September, so it's not really tour season. Still pretty busy though. Um, so I'm just gonna show you guys a couple of the shops uh, that I see right here though. So I finally made it down to the beach. Um, I think this is like the iconic uh, Positano view right here though, right behind me. Um, you got the water right here though with all the boats. So I'm about to go chill on this little beach right here. I think it's the private beach, um, El Encanto. Um, so we're gonna go lay out for a few minutes, grab a drink, get lit. Day off vibes. Just keep chilling, enjoying it, man. Let's do it. Ciao. Uh, you have te tequila? Okay, let me. Uh, 
Uh, which which tequila cocktails do you have? Uh, margarita. See? That's it. All right, so let me get a margarita, please. Yeah. Margarita? Yeah. So I've done my sunbathing, got my tan on the, on the baldy. Uh, now I, I need to go find some meat. I haven't gotten any food yet. Some food and drink, some nourishment. Uh, get the body right, you know. Uh, I'm still kind of still kind of unreal that I'm here right now though. <laughs> Gotta go get some ice cream. They got the cannolis too. Oh my God, what? Have you ever eaten something so good or had something so good you, you wanted to cry? Because you were so happy about eating it? <laughs> Boy. Like the fact that they really built houses. They really built houses on a mountain. Like, a long time ago, before the world was developed, before we had all these types of machines and, and advanced technology to do this, they did that a long time ago. I just don't see how they were able to accomplish it at such a high level. Um, that's, that's amazing to me. So, obviously, Italians are very advanced, smart people. Uh, just look at the architecture of their country. Found this really cool bike. I guess this is the San Severo bike. Chastistica bike for the season. You can ride this when you get a win. Super cool bike though. Black and yellow all season. I think I think the, the Amalfi Coast and Positano is much better at nighttime to visit or to see, um, especially in the summertime when it's still warm, when it's still nice outside. Like the view here is nuts. Right here, down on the water too. So I'm about to get uh, a boat tour excursion, private boat. They don't let, they're not letting anyone do like group trips okay. at the moment. Yes. You, we need to let you fill up here. Cognon si. means surname, si, si, name, si. Uh -huh. permanent address where you live, okay. telephone number, okay. capital letters. Right. And what's the name again? 
San Pietro. San Pietro. Hotel San Pietro. Five star hotel up there in the mountains. They got an elevator over there that will, that's inside the rock. So I just got done swimming in a, in a cold, in a cave, man. Like, I really can't believe I just did that. I can't believe that I was just in there. Some of the clearest water I've ever seen in my life. Like, it looked like it had, like, food coloring in it. So imagine, like, opening your window and just seeing, like, like, just seeing this outside of your window, though. Like, yachts and boats, like. Like, people really living out here, they just walk outside and just see this every day. They walk outside and see this every day, every time. That's crazy. So at this point of the trip, um, I'm pretty worn out, I'm ready to go. I'm gonna eat this pizza, get on the road. Um, it's been a successful trip though. I had a good time um, seeing something I never saw before. Um, definitely worth the drive, worth the money, uh, worth my time for sure. Um, I'd encourage anybody like that can that can that can visit here to visit for sure. Probably the most beautiful place on earth. But the hot sun kind of wore me out, and that boat trip just now just sucked the life out of me. So I'm ready to go back to San Severo, go back to my apartment, and sleep until practice tomorrow. So appreciate you guys coming along with me.